right, so first off, go into the description and copy that link. And you want to click on this one. All right, then click that download button. All right, click this download button again. All right, so wait for that to download. All right, so while that's downloading, right click on the Windows button, go to Disk Management. All right, so go to any drive, right click on it, shrink the volume, and then make it 5,000 megabytes. So you're gonna at least have five gigabytes free. And then make a new volume out of that. All right, then also in the description, Easy BCDs, go download that and install that real quick. All right, open this, extract it to the downloads, password 24H2. So open that up, copy all of these, copy all of this, put this onto your new drive, your new volume. Okay, so when you've extracted all of that to here, go onto here, go to add new entry, when PE, and then go to boot.wim, press the plus, when it's added, you can make that the default, put that at the top. So before we go any further, you might need to go grab yourself uh, network drivers so go ahead and do that if you haven't done that already and yeah then put them on that partition that you made so, so that you can get them in case you don't have any wi-fi or ethernet or anything anyway when that's done hold shift restart you can let go and so because we made it the default it's gonna just it's gonna be right here so just press continue and that should boot you up into the uh yeah, there we go. It's going to boot up the ISO. All right, let's do its thing. All right, then you want to click this. Do set up old version. That one looks better. Let me see if there's any way I can get it into full screen. Oh, that's as full screen as we're going to get. All right, so do your settings and all that stuff. All right, we'll do super light. Do all this, blah, blah, blah. Oh, shit, I don't have the storage for this. Wait, what? It's still going to let me. All right, then. I guess not. All right, so when the installation's done, just let it do its thing and you'll be in the desktop. Just press one on that restart your pc so like i said before if you don't have any internet just go ahead and install those drivers if you didn't watch that part and you skipped ahead and now you're screwed what you can do is use your phone plug your phone into your um to your pc download the drivers from your phone and then put the file from your phone onto your pc but yeah that's about it um i'll quickly show off yeah so that's the processes the ram usage all that stuff let's see if the toolbox will work and i'll show you how to get the processes down more all right so type uh type ghost mode can't type again type seven but i did four 1.2 gigabytes 59 process is pretty good you know fuck it i'll install the graphics drivers for the outro if you wanted to get rid of that boot menu at the start you can go on the B easy bcd app again and i'll show you what to do pretty straightforward but i'll show you what to do anyway all right so let's remove that off of there and we can remove that one as well if you want to keep windows 10 do not remove this though because you probably won't be able to boot back into it you have to add it through here yeah i'm pretty sure you have to add it through there if you do delete it so yeah anyway if you've got any other questions let me know okay yeah i'm gonna just restart real quick just to show you that there's no boot menu anymore it just goes straight into windows as you can see yep there you go straight to windows anyway so any other questions let me know in the comments i'll help you out when i can uh like and subscribe all that stuff I'm trying to hit 1k um pretty soon i'm gonna be uploading every week and all that stuff anyway uh, i'm gonna wrap this one up i'll see you guys in the next video i'm out